Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. My name is Jackie and today I am here to do another vlog. So, it is currently August 4th and today is the very start of the Tome Topple Readathon and you guys really seem to like my uh, vlogs that I did for Booktubeathon so I figured I would do a vlog for this one. So the Tome Topple Readathon is hosted by Sam over at Thoughts and Toms. I'll leave her channel as well as all the information for this readathon down in the description box below. And it is a two week long read upon where you try to read as many tomes, which are books that are over 500 pages long, as you can in these two weeks. So it runs from the 4th to the 17th of August. And yeah, so I figured I would vlog. So currently it is just past 10 a.m. and I am about to head up to Maine to go to the beach with my mom and my aunt. And we're gonna try, I'm gonna try to do some reading up there. I'm not sure how much I'm gonna get done. Um, but yeah, that's the plan for today. And then I'm gonna come home from a video, get that up on YouTube, and then I'm going out. Uh, with my parents, my brother, and my cousins who are coming in from Atlanta. Tonight we're going to go into, I think, Boston to go and do get some dinner. So that is the plan for today. So I will keep you guys posted as the day goes along. And I will see you in a little bit. Alright everybody, so I'm back and it is currently 10.30. I have not vlogged all day. So pretty much, uh, I explained this a little bit earlier. I was up in Maine all day. I was at the beach with my mom and my aunt. And then we just got home we went from the beach back home to boston and we pretty much went out with my uncle and my aunt and my cousin who were all visiting from atlanta so we were kind of <laughs> it's been a busy day i had no time to vlog at all today but you will definitely see more footage tomorrow so be on the lookout for that um but anyways i did get some reading done so the book i'm currently reading this isn't from this readathon or anything I am currently reading an essay by Benny Milan. This is a book I review by the author, so thank you so much to the author for sending me this. This is a political thriller novel, I, I guess you could call that, um, that revolves around the NSA, which is the National Security Administration. I could be wrong on that. It's something, I know it's National Security, yeah. Uh, yeah, I think it's National Security Administration. And I'm not a huge fan of thrillers. I kind of explained that in multiple videos before. I'm not a huge fan of politics, but these are working really well together. I'm really liking this book so far. I'm about three quarters of the way through it, so I'll probably finish it up tomorrow, maybe even later tonight. And then I'm also listening to an audiobook, of course. So I'm currently listening to City Fallen Angels, which is book four in the Moral Instrument series by Cassandra Clare. So. Yes, I'm about a quarter of the way through this book so far. I'm liking it. I love have loved every single book by Cassandra Care I've read so far. Um, this past not even a month. So so far so good. So the, those are the books I'm currently reading. And now as far as how this TBR is gonna work for this readathon, I'm kinda going tome top of you try to read as many books as over five hundred pages as you can. So I'm kind of starting from like the smallest one that I have on my TBR to the largest. So I was supposed to post my TBR video today, but I had no time to vlog. So that will be going up tomorrow as well as my Friday read. So I'm sorry about that, but they'll be going up tomorrow, I swear. Um, so I will give you guys a sneak peek of what I plan on reading first. I'm pr I plan on reading The Red Pyramid, which is book one in the King Chronicles trilogy by uh, Rick Riordan. So I have actually previously read this book but that was like my freshman year of high school and I was not a huge fan of it but since then it's been about seven years <laughs> since that happened and I have read more Ricky Gordon books so I kind of know what to expect what his writing style is like so I'm excited to dive back into this universe it involves uh, Egyptian mythology which is really cool so that's what I plan on reading first as far as my TBR and I'll let you guys know tomorrow in my TBR video what I plan on reading after that I go from like 500 pages exactly to over a thousand, which that is going to be one major task. I have the ebook version of that book and I am trying to get the audiobook from my library. So hopefully that will come in the next couple of days and I will let you guys know how that works out. So I'm going to end up this part of the vlog here. I'm going to pretty much this week, week you know, this readathon vlogs, um, I think I'm going to do it differently than I did with Booktubeathon last month, which I'll have those vlogs linked down below. I, instead of doing, like, last month I did two days worth of vlogs put together so, oh, every day. Instead of doing that this week, I or this time, I'm going to do 
since we have two weeks to do this readathon, I'm going to combine the first all the first seven days of this readathon together, and then post that vlog separate than the second half of the uh, readathon. So each week will have its own separate vlog. So really excited for that, and I'm going to go ahead and go do some reading. I'll see you guys probably either later tonight or good in morning, everybody, and welcome back to the vlog. So it is currently quarter of one, and I haven't vlogged all day or read anything all day. So, the plan for the rest of the day is I'm going to try to finish up City of Fallen Angels, which is my current audiobook listen, and then I'm going to try to finish up an essay and then jump into the TBR for this readathon. So hopefully that will be, I'll at least get to the readathon books by the end of the day. Also, I just uploaded my TBR video for this readathon. That will be linked down below when this video goes up. So... I'm going to go ahead and do some reading and listen to my audiobook, and I'll see you guys in a little bit from the right, so I'm back with another update. It's currently 5 o'clock, and quick rundown of how the day's gone so far. I have been listening to my audiobook pretty much the entire day. I kind of talked about it earlier. I'm about halfway through with that, so that's good. I am going to do some more reading of NSA later today, and then I'm going to move on to the Red Pyramid so I can finally start my TBR for this readathon. So that is my update for now. Hope you guys are enjoying your day. Hope you guys are enjoying your Tom Topple readathon. If you are participating, let me know. And I will see you guys in a little bit for another update. Alright folks, I'm back with another update. It's currently 9.30 and I haven't done any physical reading today. I am still finishing up City of Fallen Angels and I'm about I think last time I left you guys off, I was about halfway done with it. Now I'm about three quarters of the way done with it. I want to say, and I'm really, really liking this book. I really enjoyed all the Mortal Instruments slash Shadowhunter Chronicles uh, books I've read so far these past, what, three and a half weeks? Almost a month. So, really, really liking that so far. That should be done probably tomorrow. I'm going to continue listening to it tonight and can, uh, continue on with NSA, which is my other read right now. So that is my update for now. I'm going to go ahead and go read and I will update you guys in a little bit. Another update. It's currently just past 11 o'clock and I just finished an essay by Benny Nihon. That book I gave a 3.5 out of 5 stars. It's kind of like a political thriller slash it's got a hint of dystopian. So I really enjoyed that book and I'll have a talk more about my thoughts in that um, during either this upcoming week's Friday Reads video or in my uh, July wrap up. So hear my thoughts on that a little bit later in the month but now I can finally start my TBR for this readathon so I talked about this earlier but the first book I'm going to pick up is Red Pyramid by Rick Riordan book one of the King Chronicles trilogy so I'm really excited I have I've done I know I talked about this but I have uh, previously read this book way back in high school um, just a few years ago but I never really got into it I never finished it so I'm excited to dive back in and see what I think about it now um, so I'll probably won't update you guys again until the morning, but I will keep you guys posted on how I'm thinking, what I'm thinking about this book in the morning, so I'll see you then. Good morning everybody, welcome to day three of the Tone Tuple Readathon. So currently it is now uh, 1.30, so getting a late start on the vlog today, but pretty much I haven't done anything this morning, I haven't really listened to my audiobook. Um, as far as my reading of The Red Pyramid, I got like six pages into it and then I fell asleep. So that was my reading last night, but that is all I have to talk about for now, and I will see you guys in a little bit for the next update. Alright guys, I'm back with another update. It's currently 7.30, and I am still not done that much reading today. I have read just a tiny bit more of the audiobook, and I am going to have in the bath in a little bit and read a little bit more of the Red Pyramid. So, pretty much the kind of unproductive day, but hopefully that will pick up later on after maybe I take my bath and we'll go from there so I will see you guys after hey, guys, I'm back with another update. It's currently 11 o'clock and as far as my reading today I've not gotten the whole time done. I have been listening to my audiobook all day. I have about five hours left on that so I'll probably finish it up in the next couple of days hopefully. Um, as far as my reading in the pyramid goes I did get some more reading done on that. Not too much but I did get a uh, about 70, 80 more pages done that, so it's really good so far. It's a little slow, a little hard to get into, but I'm still enjoying it, so that's my reading for today. And I'm going to go ahead and just probably watch Netflix for the rest of the night, and I'm going to go ahead and head to bed after that, so 
I will see you guys in the morning. Good morning, everybody. Welcome to day four of the Tome Topple Readathon. So it is currently 11.30. I just got out of class. So right now I am waiting in the parking lot for my mom. She just ran into the store real quick. So as far as my reading goes, I am about 75, almost 80% done with my audiobook. So that's almost done. I should be done with that by the end of the day. And then I did get some reading done while I was at class. So I'm on page... 152 of the red pyramid like i said so far it's good i am really enjoying it um it's not as good as brick reordin's other books but i'm still thoroughly enjoying it so that has been my reading for this day i hope you guys are having a great day a great show topple if you guys are participating a great summer for you guys and i will talk to you guys in a little bit for another hey update. guys i'm back with another update it's currently quarter of nine and so far today i have read about 40 more pages since I last updated you guys uh, a few hours ago. So I'm about almost halfway done with The Red Pyramid. And then my audiobook, I have about an hour and 45 minutes left of that. So I'm probably going to finish that up in the next couple hours and get that done so I can continue on with my TBR for this readathon. That's all I have to update for you guys for now. So I will see you in a little bit. Hey everybody, so I'm back with another update. It's currently 10.30 and I just... Finished City of Fallen Angels book four in the Immortal Instruments series by Cassandra Clare. I ended up giving it a 3.5 out of 5 stars. Not my favorite book in the series, but still enjoyable in some ways. So right now I'm going to go ahead and continue reading The Red Pyramid. See how much I can get done tonight. I still have a couple more hours before I'm going to head to bed. So I will check in with you guys in probably another hour or so. So I will see you then. So I'm back with another update. It's currently midnight and I am on page 250 of the Red Pyramid. So I'm current exactly halfway through this book. So I should be finished with it I think tomorrow. So, so far so good. And now I am going to head to bed and I will see you guys in the morning. Good morning everybody. Welcome to day five of the Tome Travel Readathon. So it is currently quarter of one and I have not done any reading today. Yeah. Uh, but right now I am about to head off to the library to leave off some books and then I'm going to come home and start, or at least get most of the way done with the Red Pyramid and go from there. So I will do you guys shortly. Hi everybody, I'm back with another update. It's currently five o'clock and I have not done any reading today. Yeah. Very unproductive day, but I am now going to go ahead and film a video for my DIY channel, which if you guys don't know, I have a DIY channel. I'll have it linked down below. I got to film a tutorial for that and get it edited and uploaded, so I'm going to go do that now. I'm going to listen to some of my audiobook, which I just picked up from today, which I'll talk about a little bit later while I am doing that, so I will see you guys after I'm done filming that tutorial. Alright guys, I'm back with another update. It's currently quarter of past eight and I still have not done any reading today, but I still, I did uh, listen to a little bit of my audiobook, which is Clockwork Prince, book two in the Infernal Devices series by Cassandra Clare. So I'm about like not even 45 minutes into that, So, but so far so good. I'm definitely liking this series more than I'm liking the Mortal Instruments, but I'll talk more about that in a little bit so now i'm going to go ahead and hop into the bath continue reading my current read the red pyramid and hopefully i can get this done tonight and move on with my tbr so i will see you guys after that okay everybody so i'm back with another update it's currently 11 30 and i just finished the red pyramid by rick riordan i really enjoyed this book it was four out of five stars not my favorite by rick riordan but still thoroughly enjoyable so I have officially finished one book on my TBR for this readathon, so the next book I'm going to move on to is called The Last Magician. This is by Lisa Maxwell, and I'm excited about this. This is a YA fantasy series that follows magic. This is the Paris Utopia book club book, book pick of the month for the month of August, so I'm excited to start this. I'm going to go ahead and start reading this, and I'll update you guys in the morning. Good morning, everybody, and welcome to day six of the Tom Topple Readathon. I am currently in the dollar store parking lot, waiting for my mom to get out of the store. It's currently 12 o'clock. I just got out of class, my final class of the summer semester. I have my final exam today, so all done with that, and I can now get ready for Friday because I am going on vacation, and yes, you guys are going along with me, so that is going to be a ton of fun. 
So for the rest of the day, um, I have pretty a pretty busy afternoon. I have to go to a wake tonight, and I have some stuff to do to get ready for vacation on Friday. So that's gonna be that. I did listen to some of my audiobook for Clockwork Prince. So far, so good. I am liking this series more than the Mortal Instruments, in my personal opinion. But I'll talk about more a little bit later. So I'll, I will see you guys in a little right, bit. I'm back with another update. It's currently 10:30, and I have not vlogged all day long. So. I kind of explained this earlier. I had a really busy day. I had a bunch of yards to run. I had to go a week earlier today, so that's been done. I have actually had like very little time to read. I only got to listen to a little bit of my audiobook today, and I'm only like not even a quarter of the way through with that. So I'm actually going to go ahead and head to bed now because I've been really busy today. Tomorrow I am going on vacation on Friday, which I will be vlogging, so you guys will be able to see kind of my reading journey as I am on vacation for this week long. So that will be a lot of fun. So I gotta do some packing for that. Get all my stuff ready for that on Friday and then go from there. So I will see you guys in the morning. Good morning everybody and it is currently 1.45 and I am back in my car. It seems like every other day I'm in my car vlogging but oh well. And it is currently 1.45 and I am waiting for my own to get out of the supermarket. She's just getting a couple of things in there and then we are going to run and do some more errands after this. So I don't think I updated you guys much on my reading yesterday. I know I talked a lot about my audiobook but I did read a little bit of my physical book. Not yesterday but the day before that when I updated you guys on Wednesday. So I'm on to my next read for this TBR and that is The Last Magician by Lisa Maxwell. This is the Peru's Utopia Book Club Book of the Month for the month of August. This is a YA fantasy novel and it follows our main character who lives in a world where like magic is completely like eradicated and she has the ability to steal anything pretty much and she is sent back in time to steal I believe it's a book and it follows her journey through that. So I'm only about 32 pages into it. It's a little slow to get into, but I am liking it so far. So that's right. what I am reading right now. So I'll update you guys in a little bit. Good morning, everybody, and welcome to day seven of this readathon. So it is currently a quarter of three in the afternoon, and I've had a really busy morning. I am packing because I'm going on vacation in like 10 minutes, so. We have been kind of packing up all of our stuff to bring on vacation today, so I didn't get any reading done this morning, but we have a very long drive ahead of us, so I'm going to get plenty of reading done in the car. So I will try to update you guys as many times as I can today, but other than that, I will see you guys in a little bit. Okay, we're guys, I'm back with another update. It's currently actually 11 o'clock on Saturday, so I haven't vlogged it the past couple of days, but I was on on car ride, we drove from Boston on the way down to South Carolina, which where I am going to be spending the next week here, and for just for a quick vacation before I go back to school. So I haven't really been able to vlog um, at all these past couple days. But as far as my reading goes, I did get another 150 pages done in The Last Magician by Lisa Maxwell. So far, so good. Really enjoying this book so far. Uh, it was a little hard to get into, but now that I'm a little bit further in, I'm really enjoying it. So that's that. As far as my audiobook goes, I am still not quite as far as I would like to be in Clockwork Prince, but I am enjoying that. That it, this the, the Infernal Places series, in my opinion, is so much better than the Mortal Instruments series. That's just my personal opinion. Obviously, that could change um, a further down the road, but we shall see. And I also did start uh, a Game of Thrones by George R. R. Martin, book one in the Song of Ice and Fire series. Really excited about that. I'm not very far into it. It's absolutely huge, but it's so good so far. So I'm extremely excited about that. And that is my update. So I'm actually going to go ahead and end this vlog here. So I hope you guys have enjoyed these past seven days of vlogs. If you did, be sure to give it a big thumbs up and hit subscribe if you have not already. I'll be sure to have all uh, the information for this readathon linked down below if you guys would like to check this readathon out in the near future. I'll also have my previous playlist of vlogs from Pretty Those will be linked down below if you guys would like to check those out. And I hope you guys have a fantastic rest of your day. And I will see you tomorrow for part two of these readathon vlogs. So thank you for watching everybody. Bye.